Uh, another super chat here. Shakur and Boots taking over boxing real soon. Um, speak about that. Um, you know about you know your relationship with Boots. I've seen pictures of you guys being young um, and and just working together. Little video clips. What do you think about him? I did an interview with Keith Thurman, trying to you know make that force that fight to happen, kind of you know. And he said that you know if the paperwork comes to his desk and he believes that you know he needs to feed his family, basically saying a big payday contract, um, he would take the fight. Um, What's your thoughts on Jerome Boots Ennis at the welterweight division and that fight, you know, that marquee fight that I believe he needs? Um, me and Boots, we came up together. Uh, we was in the amateurs together. Um, I used to dominate the amateurs. So it's oh, like I, I dominated and then you got Boots. He was another person who was dominating with me. So it's like all the tournaments that we went to, uh, we was really fighting for like, best boxer of the tournament and a lot of tournaments we went to and we'll really be talking about it with each other like all right i'm gonna win or he gonna win and uh just to see like him doing his thing right now i've been new boost was the truth um you put him in the ring with a keith thurman he gonna beat the hell out of keith thurman and even with keith thurman saying like oh if i gotta feed my family uh i'll take the fight but that that, that sounds like somebody who who would take the fight for the money and not take it, not take it real serious as he should. So, um, I already know Boos, Boos, he'll, he'll, he'll destroy uh, Keith Thurman. Also in that same interview, he said that, you know, the people are calling out him and Carissa Shields for a fight more than Boots. <laughs> what were your, what's your thoughts on that? Like, I don't know if you've seen the interview. Nah, I ain't see it, but, uh, I told Clarissa if she was the uh, fight home that I'm a, Help train her, or like help work her, work with her. Yeah, that's not that's... train her, but like she could come with like us train together. So you and support her... the match, up. Yeah, hell yeah, for sure. Wow. <laughs> oh man. But but, but I'm a little biased because I got like, a close relationship with Clarice, so it's like um, I, I don't know. I just want to see her prevail, and I don't think like. As far as her being a girl, there's no girls that can, like, compete with her. Like, there's nothing that nobody would want to see and be like, okay, they can give her any competition because she's literally the greatest girl fighter on the planet. Right, right. So it's like, yeah, I, I would entertain it because it's like, okay, it gives her more of a competition. Aspect. You you speaking upon training, is that something that when the time comes that you feel like you're going to retire being in the ring, you do you feel like that's what you're going to take on next? Yeah, I probably would take on training. Uh, yeah, I, I, like I said, I love boxing, so I would definitely, like, help, like, the younger generation uh, get better. I mean, I'm already doing it, so um, that's, what, that's what I do for, like, on my regular free time, I'm with my cousins, and I'm giving him pad work and helping him out. And even little Manny, like, I, I, got, I be having Manny with me all the time. So I be, you know, I be trying to help them grow and get better and try to get them to be the best version of themselves too. So, yeah, I would yeah, definitely. I, I interviewed your team. I I show I show love to your team. 